So there's been a lot of focus on pollution in China. It's been a huge problem there. We had news this week of the U.S. Embassy recording the worst ever pollution levels in Beijing. But at the same time, China's been moving quite uh, heavily into investing in green energy. It's put $68 billion last year into the clean tech sector. Um, and that was the largest investment of any country in the world. It represented about a quarter of the global total last year, and it's been growing. Well, pollution obviously has been a big issue there, and so they need to invest in green energy just to tackle their carbon emissions and also find new sources of energy for their growing economy. Also, green energy is seen as a way to help quell some of the uh, political dissent they've seen over their environmental issues. And China is also looking to green energy as a way to help transform its economy away from sort of being the low-cost uh, factory of the world into being a country that can actually develop and export its own uh, advanced technology. There's a few implications for Canada, one of them being that obviously to tackle global pollution uh, you can't ignore the world's biggest polluter which is China, so by them investing more in green energy uh, hopefully that improves air quality for every other country. The other issue is that uh, Canadian clean tech companies, uh, they, they're looking to expand uh, their markets and so China is becoming the world's largest market for green energy and that presents opportunities for Canadian companies. Uh, and also, eventually, China is hoping to export its own technology to the West, including possibly to Canada, where we can commercialize it or where we can you know, use it to help improve our environment as well.